The Jonard JIC 4366 cable sheath stripper and ring tool is ideal for copper cables, tight buffer optical fiber cables, and for slitting figure eight or webbed cables. The tool is designed with two unique blades. The one located at the tip of the tool is for stripping and slitting cable, and the blade situated mid-span on the handle is for cable ringing. The ring feature is adjustable for either 18 thousandths or 31 thousandths thick plastic, rubber, or fabric insulation. The JIC 4366 is specifically designed for budding and stripping cables. To slit open a cable, simply insert the blade guide into the cable while allowing the blade to rest on the exterior cable jacket. Then simply pull the tool in a downward motion so the blade can slit the cable jacket open. The JIC 4366 will also work as a web slitter. To slit a figure eight or webbed cable, place the cable slitting guide on the webbing between the two cables and pull. The cable has now been slit. The JIC 4366 can also be used to ring cable jackets and perform mid-span access to cable conductors. Note both the blade and bracket are adjustable to accommodate cables ranging from 18 thousandths to 31 thousandths. To ring a cable, lift the adjusting bracket up and slide the cable between the bracket and the blade. After the tool is properly adjusted, turn in a circular motion around the cable until there is little or no resistance. Following a few simple steps, the JIC 4366 can perform a mid-span slit on a cable. Once you determine where you would like to open the cable, use the mid-handle blade and ring the cable one to two inches above and below the area you wish to open. Once you ring both areas, place the blade guide between the conductors and the cable jacket and pull. The jacket will pop open and come completely off the cable. The JIC 4366 can also be used to open tight buffer optical fiber cables. To open the buffer on an optical fiber, place the buffer tube between the adjustment bracket and blade at the top of the JIC 4366. Ring the fiber in a circular motion just one time around the cable. Remove the JIC 4366 from the cable and snap the buffer tube with your hands. You've just very easily removed the buffer.